Hello, this is Susan Olson, your instructor for BSCOM 435, here to give you some tips on how to get a great grade on the week one assignment. First of all, you need to include an example of something you have created or a creative process, say an experience that you can share with us about your personal or professional life. The creative experience I am most proud of recently is the production of flashcards for my granddaughters to learn the alphabet. We found that they got confused, especially the older granddaughter who has some learning disabilities, got confused with multiple images that could relate to the alphabet. So we created our own family-related alphabet flashcards. They are laminated and she loves them. She is using them and they include things like Grandma Susie, that's me, Susan. Papa, that's her grandpa. Bobo, that's one of my dogs. So include a creative experience that you have been part of for your paper. Next, make sure you examine the roles of incubation and process. Incubation is like marination, thinking about it, letting it sit for a while, your ideas sit for a while. Process is what is the process that you went through to actually create a successful product or experience. That means getting feedback from other people, uh, thinking about your the, re the reality of how your creativity could be used. Next, describe the development of creativity as a product, as a concept. Please refer to chapter one in the readings. I expect you to read the textbook. I have. Next, Include a discussion of two to three specific theories of creativity. You could start by looking at page five. It talks about the threshold theory. Don't be afraid of looking at other theories as well. Theories are mainly ideas that people come up with to understand why are some people creative and others not and how can we create environments that inspire creativity so good luck to you please remember use grammarly to check your uh, your um, spelling your all of your grammar and two peer-reviewed papers. I have posted a video about Grammarly and a video about peer-reviewed papers. So I'm expecting you to do your best and I look forward to learning about your creative experiences.